Welcome back to my channel. Tell about your scary ghost videos number 41. And before I get into this, I just want to say please have subscribe button, hit thumbs up, really helps our channel. Also, check out my other videos. Wait, let's get in this. God help me, I hate scary videos. Homeowner Morgan Lambert experienced a terrifying moment when her home security system alerted her to movement in her living room. On the evening of August 25th, 2024, while relaxing upstairs, Morgan received a notification that sent shivers down her spine. What? Concerned that a burglar might have broken into her home, Morgan quickly checked the security feed, and what she saw left her horrified. It's a little hell? after 10 p.m. The security footage shows what appears to be a man standing in the corner of the living room, uh -uh. facing the wall. Yo, that's creepy. At first, it is hard to make out, but if you brighten the image, a distinct figure can be seen standing eerily still. What the fuck? Hell no. Terrified, Morgan and her husband rushed downstairs to confront what they feared might have been an intruder. To their shock, when they arrived, the figure was nowhere to be found. <laughs> they conducted a thorough search of the home but found no sign uh -huh. of a break-in or any place where a large male adult could hide. The footage has since gone viral, capturing the attention of viewers worldwide. Many expressed their support and concern for the couple, urging them to call the police for a thorough investigation of the property. Others, however, speculated that the incident might have had a supernatural explanation, suggesting that the camera had captured a ghost lurking in their living room. Weird. As the debate continues, one thing is clear, this chilling encounter has left Morgan Lambert and her husband, along with many viewers, deeply unsettled and wondering what truly happened in their home that fateful night. First of all, I've been an EMT just for a little bit in. Like, I ain't never experienced nothing like this. In mid-August 2024, a Tennessee-based ambulance driver named Dupree had an unsettling experience while working the night shift that's since gone viral. Dupree, who was driving back to base, was terrified when he noticed what appeared to be a face in the rearview mirror. <laughs> Alarmed, Sorry. he immediately pulled over and began filming <laughs> to document right. the bizarre occurrence. Yeah, I'd be freaking out. Like, I ain't never experienced nothing like this. So, so as we driving back to base, I swear I seen a face in the rearview mirror. Approaching the ambulance cautiously, Dupree sets his phone down in the front seat for a moment. No, no, he don't know. What? I don't know if you see it, but can, can y'all see that back door? Like, is That's when his camera captures something truly eerie. Watch. Can you, oh. Somebody in there. No, nah, what the f blurry as hell, but can you see it? no, we can't. No, nah, hell no. Nah. The footage shows a dark figure zipping back and forth in the back of the ambulance at an unnatural speed. Can you oh. No, nah, what the f can you see it? No, nah, hell no. Nah. The clip has sparked a flurry of speculation and debate among viewers. Many believe that the dark figure is the ghost of a deceased patient who died in this very ambulance. Maybe. Dupree's encounter adds to a growing list of unexplained incidents experienced by night shift workers, particularly those in professions closely tied to life and death. As the video continues to circulate, it raises questions about the possibility of lingering spirits and the haunting of emergency vehicles. Is this a genuine paranormal event or simply a trick of the light? Whatever the case, Dupree's footage has certainly captured the imagination of many. Can you, oh, oh. No, what the f Can you see it? No, hell no. 
and he quit that day, guaranteed. That's the like drawbridge thing. Oh, in like a moat. Yeah. Hell on Earth, a popular UK-based urban exploration YouTube channel, is known for its eerie and thrilling adventures through long-forgotten places. Oh man, this is creepy. It's proper creepy. It's like a proper haunted house, isn't it? In this episode, the team ventures into an abandoned army prison service building belonging to the Ministry of Defence, and the experience quickly takes a sinister turn. Oh, are we going to make a point about this being like only second, 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 third? As the team enters the decrepit structure, it becomes apparent that the building's been unused for a significant period of time. It is winter, yeah. I've had hope for this door. Well, you don't like it. You have the eerie silence is broken only by the unsettling sight of numerous dead birds scattered throughout the property. Ew! <laughs> Ew! That thing has burnt out. And then it says die on the wall? <laughs> They've been murdered? Venturing upstairs, they stumble upon a chilling message <laughs> scrawled across a wall. Too many birds. This place is f***ing weird as f***. Room after room, the disturbing discovery of dead pigeons continues. <laughs> While exploring one of the upstairs rooms, the team is startled by a voice calling out. What? You hear that? Terrified, they immediately switch off their torches and remain silent. It soon uh -oh. becomes clear that a security guard is patrolling the property. The guard informs them that the police are on their way, and as they <coughs> wait, an unsettling conversation takes place. Have a listen. Alright, we'll, we'll just get off. No, 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 you have to stay there. Why? Stay there, please, the way. Stay there. You just want to see you as well. Alright, okay. You as well. You know how long we'll be? I mean, I don't know if you know why there are so many dead pigeons. Because it's the ghosts. It's the ghosts. <laughs> that is haunted. With a straight face, he insists the presence of ghosts is the cause of all the dead birds, <laughs> leaving the team bewildered. Because it's the ghosts. It's the ghosts. <laughs> that is haunted. A ghost is going around the cracking. Well, I'm serious. That is haunted in there. Oh, that is. So could this old building truly be haunted? What's behind all the dead birds? This episode leaves viewers with more questions. And that's why I don't go into any abandoned places. The security guards and they'll call the cops on you. Uh-uh. It's the answers as they ponder the eerie occurrences in this long forgotten Ministry of Defense property. This is die on the wall. They've been murdered. Seriously, they have been murdered. TikTok user the unknown RGB recently posted an eerie video documenting their experience Why using the infamous so geolocation stupid. app Rando Nordica. For those Random unfamiliar, Nautica. Randonautica sends We're users to randomly is. generated nearby coordinates, asking adventurers to set out with a specific goal in mind. The app gained infamy in 2020 when TikTok user Ugg Henry discovered a dead body in a suitcase while using it. Yeah, that's good way to get to yourself thrown in jail. speculation that the app might be cursed and could lead users to danger. In June 2024, the unknown RGV and a group of friends decided to try their luck with the app, following its suggested location in McAllen, Texas. The app directs them to a dead-end road in the middle of a field. And they got the window open too. As Yo, they crazy. reach their coordinates, they're met with a chilling sight. Is someone running? No. Someone or something started running in the pitch dark hey, yeah. area. A dark figure can be seen running at full speed in the middle of the field, despite the near <coughs> pitch black conditions. Someone running? Bro. <laughs> Dude, that's just too fast. Though. There is fa it's fast, right? Yes. The video has since gone viral, with huh. viewers speculating about what the group might have encountered. Some suggest it could just be a person playing a prank while others believe it might be something more sinister or even paranormal. 
To this day, the group has no idea what they saw, adding to the growing number of mysterious and eerie experiences reported by Randonautica users. Oh, there's someone running? F***ing out of my window. You can stop. <laughs> okay. Here's a quick and weird one from TikTok user JoJetJing143. Jo 3 Jet a.m. and the user's working the night shift when suddenly he spots this. What the hell's that? What is that? A strange figure can be seen standing in the middle of the road. He's got a cane or holding a gun. The sighting has gone viral with thousands of comments pouring in trying to make sense of the bizarre nighttime encounter. Some viewers are seeing a small man in overalls holding a bat or machete. Others, however, just see a coyote standing front on. So where do you land? Tiny knife wielding maniac or front facing prairie wolf? Let me know down below. It does look like a coyote. Huh. Weird. Sticking what with the eerie hell? nighttime sightings, this next one comes from the TikTok user Tupac the Don. Take a look. Yo, it's looking at a you. A brief clip shows an unidentified animal standing in the road. Naturally, a lot of commenters jump straight to calling this a skinwalker sighting. Other, more grounded suggestions said it could just be a coyote with a severe case of mange. Yeah. So what do you think? Are you team mange or team skinwalker? Cast your Looks votes like in the comments down below. Looks like a skinwalker. Looks like something from the Silent Hill movie. Coming up in our last segment in just a few seconds, we take a look at a truly unsettling vacation photo. But before we do, remember to hit that subscribe button, then turn on all yeah. channel notifications. Mine that too. way you'll be notified every time we drop our scary and intriguing episodes. Our last eerie sighting of the day was posted to TikTok by Damn That's Creepy. This couple were on vacation when they visited this scenic waterfall. They took several snaps and moved on with their day, not thinking too much about it. However, later that night when reviewing the snaps, they I'm looking at something. What the hell is this? They were freaked out by what they saw. What is that? In one of the photos, a mysterious figure can be seen sitting on yeah, a rock see? in the background. Huh. The couple were certain that they were one of the only ones hiking in the area that day and wouldn't have posed for the photo if someone was in the background that they were trying to capture. Zooming in, the figure looks out of place and appears to be wearing a long flowing white dress. Some viewers even think it looks like the person has wings. Huh. So what do you Maybe. think's been caught on camera here? Love to hear your theories on this one in the comments down below. That's crazy. <clears throat> Let's add a bonus clip. Over on our second channel. So oh, okay. Just talking about the second channel. Anyways, that is scary ghost videos number forty-one. If y'all like that, please hit subscribe button, hit thumbs up, or not even comment. Other than that, take care for now.